we will find a inverse with the help of elementary method suppose i am taking one question 3 10 2 7 like this okay what basic thing i have to follow is a is equal to i into a because i is multiplied to anything will give you the same thing and finding a inverse i have to write i by a this thing we will use throughout in our elementary method to find a inverse see what we are doing here if i am writing a is equal to i into a it is coming out to be a is 310 27 i we know 1001 0, 0, 1 into a firstly i have to bring here 1 this can be done if at r1 i write r1 minus r2 so it will give you 1 3 2 7 r2 is remaining same same operation we have to do here so on doing r1 minus r2 it is 1 minus 1 0 1 a again okay. now i have to bring a zero here that can be brought if i go for in r2 r2 minus 2 into r1 the r2 will become 0 1 this is remaining 1 3 and same way we have to make changes r2 here this is 0 minus 2 into minus 2 and this is 1 minus minus 2 that is 3 and it is remaining same 1 minus 1 a okay so almost we got but this 3 has to be made 0 this can easily be done if i write at r1 r1 minus r2 2 into r2 3 into r2 sorry because i have to make it 0 r1 minus 3 r2 so it is coming out to be 1 0 0 1 correspondingly i have to make the change here it is coming out to be r1 minus that is 1 minus 3 into minus 2 minus 6 that is coming out to be 7 and here minus 1 minus 9 that is minus 8 and it is remaining same a now see this is i if i write this as i and bring this a here i am left with this thing 7 minus 8 minus 2 3 like this and what is this we know by basic definition this is a inverse so automatically we got a inverse this is the way we find a inverse one more example i am taking 2 1 1 1 like this okay i have to find a inverse here same method i will follow a is equal to i into a so this is 2 1 1 1 is equal to 1 0 0 1 a okay so i have to make here 1 what i will do at r1 i will go for r1 minus r2 simply so it will be 1 this is 0 and this is 1 1 same way we have to make the change at r1 here this is 1 this is minus 1 0 1 a again okay. so almost the thing is done i have to make 1 0 here this can be easily made by operating as r2 r2 minus r1 what will be the result 
at R2 it will be 0, 1, it is 1, 0. Change will take place at R2. This is R2 minus R1, so minus 1. And R2, 1, minus, minus, this is 2, 1, minus 1, remaining same, A. And again we know that this is I. And I by A is going to give us A inverse. So this is I. I am bringing this A here. It is A inverse. And A inverse we are getting automatically. So this is A inverse. Now I will find A inverse in a matrix which is 3 into 3 order. Suppose it is 2, 0, 1. 5, 1, 0, if you write it minus 1 and third row 0, 1, 3. Okay. You just follow the basic principle that is A is equal to I into A. So this A is here 2, 0, minus 1, 5, 1, 0, 0, 1, 3 is equal to I. I is here 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Okay? So, what thing you have to do? First thing I told you, make this thing as 1. How can you make this thing as 1? You can make this thing as 1 if you just take two common from R1. That means if you R1 is divided by 1 by 2, it is going to give you 1, 0, minus 1 by 2. All the things are remaining same. 0, 1, 3. See? And here also if you are dividing by 2, it is 1 by 2. 0, 0 and the things are remaining same. 0, 0, 1 like this. Okay. A. So this operation we have gone for. Now I have to make two zeros here. Where? Here and here. Luckily here it is. So if at R2 I go for R2 minus 5 into R1. So, the change will take place at R2 and R2 will become here 0. If you multiply this R2 minus this, this is becoming 1 and this is 0 minus 5 by 2 is 5 by 2. All the things remaining same 1, 0, minus 1 by 2. Okay, same way you take changes at R2. So R2 minus 5 into that is minus 5 by 2. Here it is remaining 1 and here it is remaining 0, 0, 0, 1, half, 0, 0. You have to do little bit carefully. Because if you make any mistake, plus minus mistake, uh, you will not get the correct answer. Okay. Now I got two zeros here. One is here. One is here. Zero is luckily here. I have to make zero here, zero here and one here. Now I will make this thing as zero. How can we? I make this? See. If at R3, firstly this, this has to be one. This is 1, if I am making this 0, our work will be easier. See, if at R3, I go for R3 minus R2, R3 will be 0, 0, and this is 1 by 2, and the things are remaining same, 1, 0, 1, 5 by 2, 1, 0, minus 1 by 2. Okay. 
same way r3 minus r2 is going to give you here 5 by 2 r3 minus r2 this is minus 1 this is 1 this is minus 5 by 2 1 0 1 by 2 0 0 like this into a now the things are becoming simpler i have to make now zero here this can be easily made you see because i have to attain the structure of 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 like this here at r1 if i go for r1 plus r3 at r1 if i go for r1 plus r3 it is coming out to be 1 0 no change here and it is becoming 0 r2 is remaining same 0 1 5 by 2 0 0 1 by 2 okay and here if i go for at r1 r1 plus r3 okay so this is coming out to be 3 this is coming out to be minus 1 and this is coming out to be 1 this is minus 5 by 2 1 0 5 by 2 minus 1 1 into a see now things are becoming simpler and 0 0 is attained here 0 1 now I have to make here 0 firstly go for zeros one will automatically come make one here and then uh, hunt for 0 0 0 0 okay so if I go for here making zeros so at R2 I have to go for operation at R2 minus 5 into R3 so R2 will become 0 1 5 by 2 minus 5 by 2 0 this is remaining same 1 0 0 0 0 1 by 2 what operation I have gone for at R2 R2 minus 5 into R3 so R1 is remaining same R3 is remaining same only change will take place at R2 so if I multiply this 5 this will be 15 by 2 minus 5 by 2 minus 15 by 2 that is minus 20 by 2 that is coming out to be minus 10 if I multiply minus 1 with 5 that will be minus 5 and subtract it from R to 1 this is coming out to be 6 and here if I multiply 1 with 5 this is coming out to be 5 0 minus 5 is minus 5 okay now almost the thing is done I have to make it 1 so if I multiply R3 by 2 2 into R3 is giving us 0 0 1 it is 1 0 0 0 1 0 again okay. and here what operation I have done here I have to do that thing here R3 2 to be multiplied so it is becoming 5 this is minus 2 this is 2 this is minus 10 6 minus 5 this is 3 minus 1 1 a this is I so we got when this is I and if I bring that A to this side this is I by A which is actually A inverse and we got it this is 3 minus 1 minus 5 minus 10 6 minus 5 3 minus 1 1 it was 1 okay minus 10 6 minus 5 5 minus 2 2 this is a inverse little bit long process but if you systematically follow it you will get a inverse